the Apple device here and today I'll be showing you how to manually back up your contacts well manually back up your whole iPhone pretty much so contacts notes etc so without iTunes I'll go ahead and show you you have to open up Cydia and you need one download for this A F C two add you'll only have one it'll be mod my eye this is from a different repo just download it doesn't matter what repo it's from so just either one would work download it once you've downloaded it it'll ask you to reboot you can just lock your phone after you reboot set it down phone iPad touch iPad same thing okay and you wanna go ahead and download this program iFunbox I'll have it in the links description once you've opened it you wanna go ahead and open up. Oh, click on the click on the device you have right there, and click on raw files. And I have a side note I have right here because it, it's in, it's pretty much impossible to memorize it. So to get the contacts, you want to go ahead, go to var, mobile, and library. Once you're in library, you want to go ahead and click applications. Sorry, camera kind of off. I wasn't paying attention. And then both of these files right here, just copy them. That'll be your address books, your contacts pretty much. For your SMS, you want to go ahead. I'll go back once. I believe so it's here that the SMS is right there. You want to go ahead and copy this file right here to whatever you want to. And then calendar, I'll go back once. Calendar is right here. Copy this file to wherever you want it to copy. Copy it. You can copy any file by just dragging it and dropping it. Simple as that. And then I'll go back once again. And notes is right there. You want to go ahead and copy both of these files to wherever you want. And then this pretty much backs up everything. Your notes, contacts, messages, and yeah, calendar. If you then once you restore your iPhone, iPod Touch, iPad. You want to go ahead and that, then re-jailbreak it. If the jailbreak is out, make sure you make sure you see if the jailbreak is, is out. Then um, you download that one download to SSH, and then you go ahead and do this. It's really simple. Um, yeah, then you just SSH drop these files back into their place, replace them, and then and then it'll be back as normal, pretty much. So okay, I'll have I'll have this link. Will not link. I'll have this information in the link's description if um, it's too large to fit in the, in the description I'll provide a link down there so okay rate comment subscribe follow me on Twitter and peace out